What's up everybody, Matt from Cemetery Filth here. Um, doing a quick little review, because who wants to watch a long review of a four song demo, right? But this is a sick new demo. Um, I didn't even know it till now, but it's limited to 15 copies, so it was a complete surprise that I just got in the mail one day. Um, these guys rule, thank you so much for sending it to me. I love your work and super stoked on the progress you're making here with this new demo. Um, so yeah, these guys, uh, I heard about them first through uh, their team ups with Mulder. They did a small tour together last year and then uh, uh, they actually did a split together, which was sick, man. It, uh, it was on vinyl and tape. If it's still available, definitely get it. It rules. Uh, each band had a few of their own tracks and then a cover by each band. Um, but yeah, man, rules. Uh, these guys these guys are awesome. They have a very simple kind of bread and butter technique that I, I highly approve of. Um, and right off the bat, man, you hear the, the Florida death metal influence. And uh, I'm a big fan of that if you don't know me. Um, uh, you know, wearing a Florida band. Even though it has terrible artwork on it, I had to buy it anyways because they're one of my favorites. But uh, yeah, man, um, a lot of progress heard on this, especially, and I'm hearing a lot more dynamics in the drums, which I'm a big fan of. I like a drummer that do, that does a little bit more than just the meat and potato kind of, you know, basic drums and then fills. So uh, I definitely like that. Um, but yeah, uh, a lot of Florida influence right off the bat. Uh, first, first song in the first track, Necrotized. Uh, I mean, the first riff um, in that track uh, really reminds me a lot of Melvin Creation, which I'm a huge fan of. Um, and then uh, as it goes on, you know, you hear it a lot more. Um, I hear some bolt thrower, I hear some death, I hear some brutality. Um, I hear a lot of massacre, actually, which is kind of close to the death realm. But um, I, I don't know. It's a good mix of everything, man. It's These guys have something special going on and really, really dig it. Really stoked on what's to come after this one. Um, but yeah, yeah. Uh, Necrotized, yeah, just nice ripping track. Got some slow chuggy moments like you're hearing right now, and then um, uh, Core Premises. Uh, I don't know, man. Killer song too. Uh, there's one part where I swear I think Hayden Hayden yells. I think Core Premises. Uh, I could be wrong, but it, to me it sounds like he's yelling Bride of Insect, which uh, is an old nuclear death. Release, so I don't know why, but I just thought that was a funny note that I made for some reason in these notes I have. Um, and Mechanical Separation, a great, great, great tune. There's actually some Napalm Death uh, sounding stuff in there that I dig. Um, so uh, I don't know, I dig it, man. Uh, some really cool riffing going on in that one. And then uh, Miasma of Brutality, the last track, fucking kicks ass too, of course. Um, it's actually got a very Morgan Autopsy-esque kind of start to it that I really dig. Um, but yeah, man, uh, if you guys don't know Coffin Rot from the Pacific Northwest, give them a listen, because they, they rule, they're doing it right. Um, nice, nice, just simple, old-school death metal feel, you know, but it still has an original soul and original fire to it. So go, if you can, go give it a listen. This rules. Um, get that split with Molder and wait around for the next big release from these dudes. Coffin Rot rules. Full support.